everybody, this is Praxis, and I think I remembered what it is that I prefer about carpentry, and it is that you can make a lot of visual progress in a very small amount of time. If you remember where I was yesterday, this is today, at just about the same time, so it's like one day of work, and wow, what a difference. <laughs> you know, I got all the rails are all in. Uh, I'm about to put it in the first to floor joist. Um, I want to talk a little bit about kind of what I did here. Uh, these are two by sixes. Uh, that run along here. There are two of them, one on either side, and they're going onto those notches. Uh, I've got an 8-foot one and a 10-foot one. The 8-foot one ends here, the 10-foot one ends here. There's a staggered joint there, and I've got a little piece in the middle that I put in is kind of like a splint, and then I've got it screwed together, so I've got one continuous run right across it. Uh, this here is the floor joist. is made with the same uh, 2x10s that are in the house. Uh, the ones that are here are ones that I didn't use in the house because they were ugly for some reason. I, I had a few extra and I, and I bought a few others. This one's got like a rough spot. Some of them got stains, things like that. So they're going to be perfectly fine for the woodshed. Uh, as you can see, there are posts kind of coming up out of the uh, ends of this floor joist. And this floor joist is kind of similar to this. This is two 2x6s two with a gap. This is two 2x10s two with a gap in the middle. And these uh, posts are stuck into that gap. Now these are not final posts. These are uh, temporary posts. The reason that I have them in there is that the final post is going to be made out of, out of uh, three 2x4s uh, uh, stuck uh, all nailed together. And the middle 2x4 is going to extend down into the middle just the same way that it was done in the house. Uh, and I've got these guys because the dimension of a 2x4, the thickness is one and a half inches. These are uh, these are boards that are like 2x3s that were used in uh, packing. Uh, you know, like a uh, packaging lumber and stuff like that. Oftentimes it gets delivered. These guys will be on the bottom. And these are, I think, like rough sawn. So instead of being one and a half inches, they're a little bit thicker. So I've used these here. So, and I've got them clamped uh, right here. So when I go and I nail these boards in, the boards don't uh, get too tight together. And when I yank these guys out later, it's going to leave a little bit of extra room. So when I put that post in, it's not going to be terribly difficult to get the post in. When I did my first house, I, I wasn't that careful about it. And putting some of those posts in, it was really difficult to slide them in there. So I'm going to be using a, a 16 D nail, 16 penny nails to uh, put these guys in so that they don't get banged around a bunch. I'm going to pre-drill uh, the, the pilot holes for them. So I've got, uh, this is a 5 30 seconds drill, not that matters, it's just it's a, bit, it's a little bit thinner than the, the nail itself. Okay, so I'm doing that. And again, the reason for that is it just makes it so that the nail kind of, there it goes. It makes it so that the nail uh, doesn't, you know, knock this board around a ton before it gets its bite. Okay, I'm putting my hands on the back side here to feel it to make sure I'm not hammering this off the edge. I've already started to do that a little. Okay, so I'm putting it back, and here we go. Okay, I can feel that bit. It pushed it a little bit further off the other side. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to start working on the, uh, the nail on the other side, kind of nail it back in a little bit. So I'm doing that same kind of angled hole. All right, grabbing a 16D nail, and this one I'm going to sink. And that's going to push the, uh, the board back to where we want it. Okay, nice and flush now. So now I can finish this guy up. Okay, that's not the best hammering job, but it got the job done. All right, so now what I got to do, do the other end. I'm, I'm going to put two other nails in here. I'll be four nails at either end. Finish this up, do the other end. And then I've got five more to do. And after that, decking. The rest of it's, I'm excited about the rest of it. I like carpentry. And now I know why. That's it. Thanks for watching.